Hey guys and welcome back to the Retro Show. I'm Joe if you're new around here and make sure you do subscribe for regular retro gaming content. Now this week we're doing something a little bit different. Uh, over the last few weeks we've done some sports games but I thought we'd delve into some of the collection that I, you know, I, I really do enjoy as well which is sort of the action stealth genre as well. Uh, we'll see how it does and if you guys enjoy it then we'll do... Uh, a lot more of it uh, in the future. Um, no, we need to do do a new profile apparently. So we'll we'll just stick in uh, cap uh, for that. You know, if I if I go back to this game, which uh, I undoubtedly will at some point, um, I'll make a different uh, different one, of course. So uh, we'll save that. And uh, yeah, this is Hitman Blood Money, released in two thousand and five. Uh, still widely regarded as the the best Hitman game in the series. Uh, certainly one of my favourite games of all time. Absolutely brilliant, and uh, I th I think it'll still hold up well. I thought it would be a very uh, good game to to, to do. Uh, seen it on my shelf today, and uh, thought we'd give it a go for this one. You can see somebody sitting there quite creepily. Uh, I'm not sure about subtitles and stuff like. Oh no, there you go. Uh, we'll just have some subtitles. Sometimes easier for you guys if there's uh, uh, some subtitles there. But uh, let's start the game and uh, get into it. Uh, we'll stick it on normal. Confirmed reports of an accident at Southland Park. I can't find my boy! Hundreds of family members gathered outside the deserted park today to commemorate the second anniversary of the Southland Park tragedy. The children are attending children. the full investigation of the park's safety Authorities procedures. report at least 30 deaths and close to 100 Five injuries. years since the tragedy closed the gates of Southland Park, but new evidence is claiming malicious prosecution and believes he'll be vindicated at every last. penny of his fortune the so defending legal himself eagles from these dream lawsuits. Team defending Southland Park all the oh, There were people flying everywhere. It was body parts. And the victim's Blood. families oh, have God. vowed to appeal the decision. Not guilty. Cleared of all charges. Death of a Showman is the first one. Sorry, it's a little bit quiet. It's a little bit quiet on my end as well. Um, I've, I've tried to turn up the in-game volume uh, so you can maybe hear what's going on. This training level will introduce to you the various skills and techniques required to effectively undertake the missions ahead. The action menu is displayed in the upper left corner of the screen. Actions that can be performed and their corresponding buttons are displayed here. The bars in the lower left corner represent, starting from the left, health status and tension. The icon in the lower right corner displays the currently equipped item and its ammo status. Displayed at the top of the screen, the headlines will offer suggestions on what to do next. 
The exclamation mark appears every time new information is present. Press the select button to enter the information menu at any point. Use the left analog stick to move around the environment and the right analog stick to control the camera. Push the left analog stick lightly to walk and push it fully to run. To sneak, hold the L1 button while moving. Right then, here we go. And uh, I'll first look at the graphics and uh, yeah, you know, they're not too bad. Obviously the render distance is uh, fairly poor. Uh, this is the sneaking, by the way, if you, you guys are curious. Um, but uh, no, I just remember this game being absolutely fantastic when it came out at the time. And, uh, you know, it still looks pretty decent, you know, for a 14-year-old game. This should be a straightforward operation. We need you to penetrate an abandoned amusement park, locate the owner, and take him out. The target is a Joseph Clarence, also known as Swing King. An accident involving one of the rides at the park a few years back forced him to close it down. Our client has made a special request that the photograph you have in your possession be the last thing the target sees. Mr. Clarence has somehow become involved with a narcotics distribution ring, so the park may still have some amusements. Enjoy the ride, 47. Enjoy the ride indeed. Uh, quite an awful accident at the start of this um, episode. Um, right, I think we're going to have to... Can we climb over this? Uh oh, I don't think we want that out, do we? <laughs> uh, got to find a way onto the pier, so we'll have a, a little look around this way. You, I don't know why I can't jump up there. Um... You looking at Kraken? I'm here to see Joseph Clarence. Never heard of him. Mr. Swing King. Oh, that sorry ass dickhead. What the fuck they call you? Names are for friends, so I don't need one. <laughs> okay. I could swear we put the uh, subtitles on, by the way. But, uh, can we drag his body away? No. Check photo in inventory. Press and hold the square button. Okay. So where's the photo? There we go. Into the gift shop. Was closed doors behind you. Distract the guards. Okay. Have we got any sort of coins? There we go. So, if you can hear the the disc running in the background, by the way, it's. Uh, very loud. Right, we don't want that. Um, I don't want you press to. Oh. Right, let's get another coin now. Here we go. It's a square? Right, what button is it? Let's have a look. Oh, they're coming this way. I don't know. Let's pause it. It's making some weird noises. Alright, let's have a little look in the, the guide. Um, controls are weird for this game. Uh, what does R1 do? Just says, yeah, fire weapon, I guess. I guess that's what we want to do, isn't it? Really creepy music, though. We haven't distracted them enough, though. They're coming 
this way. Can we go out there? Nope. Ooh. Ah. Well, this has gone wrong. I didn't want to have to kill them. Well, that w that just came from not knowing the buttons. Well, anyway, we've got to enter the theatre now. Right, let's put that away. I'll just try to knock them out. Right, can we look through the keyhole? Oh my god. That was a bit terrifying. Right. Guy over there. And go kill the gangster. Right, let's get the fiber wire out. Don't know what he's looking at. I'm gonna assume it's nothing rude. I mean I swear to God. I am just a lawyer. Help! Help me! Ah, oh, you can drag bodies, okay. Help me. Let's drag him over here then. I'm glad the creepy music stopped, by the way. I was. Help. Do we help, help this guy? Help. help me! Can we? Oh, come on. Let us help him. Apparently not. Right, climb up to the red trellis. Oh, or climb up the red trellis, okay. That's what we're doing. So we'll just do this uh, first mission, and uh, if I was to do a, um, if I was to do a, a let's play on it, it would be on the HD version uh, on the PS3. But uh, if you'd like to see it, you know, let me know. Right. Put that away. Into the room next door. Okay, so we'll go pick the lock. Oh, God. Oop! Come on. The controls are not intuitive at all. Come, they've got no uh, ammo. Come on. We've got no weapons. This is gonna be bad. Um. This way? Is that where we go? I'm not sure. I'm not sure where we're going here. So, okay, so we weren't meant to come in here. Oh, we can pick that up. Ah, oh, dispose of the two gangsters, okay. Right. So I don't think there's any way to get Silent Assassin on this one, to be fair. I'll hoi him in here. There you go. Ah, so that that mu that's music. I thought it was somebody uh, talking. Right. So we'll open that. Oops. How do you end up over here? Come on. 
Well, I guess we could stick them in the, the closet, actually, over here. Why not? Look at him. <laughs> right. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Can we not? We'll have to stick them in this, then. There we go. On later games, you can stick them in closets. Hide in the closet. There we go. That was lucky. Taking out the chemist. Okay. Him. To your key card and clothes. Okay, so we're now seeing our first disguise of the game. Enter the atrium. Not this way. Yep. Okay. Continue along the walkway. Good evening, sir. Are you okay? Right. Place gun in green crate? Okay. Pick it up. Enter control room. This is cool. This is what Hitman's all about. It doesn't guide you through this way or um, in all the missions. You've got to just come up with this yourself. Uh, but you've just got so much freedom. Gotta check you, white bread. Okay. Alright, you cool. So now we go in. Put down the green crate. Okay. Retrieve the gun. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Never mind. Get on top of the I didn't elevator. Get the money, sweetie. It's as good as mine already. Mr. Spook's got it. We'll open the park. It'll be like old times. No, no, just a few more days. You gotta believe me. Won't say that, sunshine. Mr. Spook's gonna come through, baby. He's good for the money. I won't sign the papers. I won't. You gotta give me one more chance. You gotta. Baby cakes? Sunshine? Hello? Oh. oh! Oh, we are on top, okay. Fiber wire the guard below. Okay. And at an exit the elevator. Is that what we want? Or did it? Ha! <laughs> I think it meant actually through the door. Right. Here we go. Disable the power. This way. Enter the toilet. 
Okay. Clear the room. Oh my god. There we go. Is he dead? No, he's alright. Knock him out. We'll climb up the ladder. Oh! There's somebody down here. Come on. Time to go. Whoops. It's uh it's been a while now, uh, scoop, and I was just wondering uh, where we were on the whole money thing. Were you? Yeah, see, the thing is, if you remember, you know what we agreed to was it'd just be a short while and you'd pay in cash and uh, I know the what the pressure was you were under must be, but the deal is a deal, and I was hoping, you know, maybe you could just pay what we agreed on, even though you've been here for <laughs> more than twice as long as we agreed to, but, but just pay the original amount and move on. Not right away, necessarily, but, you know, I'd appreciate it. No. I would say poor guy, but, uh, you know, right. Oh, so you gotta pick it up and then I guess hold square, there you go. We'll unpack it. Drunk enough, snipe three guards outside, okay. So how do we aim? It's a good question. Okay. Aha. So I'm going to snipe the three guards outside. So, he's there. No idea how you hold your breath. So one down. There's the other one. There's one. Right. Gotta be an option to hold your breath. Surely. Ah, this is probably better for getting the initial aim and then. Right. Don't go down. There's gotta be another one in there somewhere. Let's snipe the three guards down, so we've uh, got two of them. Now where's the third? Where is he? Is he on here? There's a bird. Hmm. Where's the other guard? Can you guys see him? Oh, is there another window? Nope. Come on. Can you see on this maybe? So there's a guy back there. Oh, I think he's potentially in the office down there. So let's see. Is he? Sort of say down there, didn't it? It's a bird, obviously. 
What was it down there? Was it just on the roof? Am I blind? Right, let's shoot one of the birds. Right. Snipe the three guards. Or is there anybody else over there? I don't know what that is. It's got to be down there, surely. It's got to be. Press the R3 button until you enter the scope. Press up and down on the directional buttons to zoom in and... Okay. So we can zoom in. It's fine to zoom in if you know where you're looking. Where is he? Right, I'll see you guys when I find him. Right guys, I think I've found him. I think it's him up here. On the uh, on the Ferris wheel, which is a bit harsh, I think. But, uh, you know, you guys probably spotted him a long time ago. Where's he gone? Oh, this is idiotic. Right, there he is. Right. There we go. Right. Get outside. Finally. How do we get outside? Right. Are we going this way? Yeah. Climb down the drain. Okay. Here we go. Don't know how they didn't hear the... Uh, Uh, the sniper gun shots. The the other two, one, once I'd shot one, how the other two didn't uh, hear, but never mind. Right. Where are we going? Find the door to the office. Well, it must be. Must be this. And here. Where did it. Uh, so the office is this way, okay. Well, there we go. Pick up the syringe. Okay. I don't know what's going up on on up these stairs, but uh, let's pretend we don't know. God damn, girl! I'd have your fine ass unwrapped before you could say, "Oop, that handsome stud on time my river." I bet you could. Right. <laughs> That's Uncle Joe. Better get back to your post. <laughs> God, just push him over the rail, apparently. Poison secretary drink. Okay. I swear to God, Uncle Joe, no one can buy it all. Except Dell, and he's not a bum. I'm sure he's not. Thanks, Karen. That's it. Hide in the closet. So we just gonna wait now. And there she is. Go on, have a sip. There you go. You go and meet your, meet your lover. Well, that was uh, fairly dramatic. Right, enter the office. Who the hell are you? How'd you get in here, Carolyn? My client has hired me to show you this photograph. I don't understand. My client has asked me to ensure it's the last thing you ever see.
please. Look at the photograph, Mr. Clarence. Oh, please. Haven't I suffered enough? Don't you think I know how much suffering I'm responsible for? Oh. He's dead. Right, let's insert this into his head. There we go. He's dead. Climb out of the office window. Where's the office window? This one. Here we go. Right, now where we're going. Pick up the bomb. Okay. Locate okay, exit on the map. Okay. So we've got to come round here. Probably go through another doorway or so. So through here. Through the window. If we can line it up. Come on. Maybe I need to put that away. There we go. Place bomb on the on the wench. So is that this? Oops. Place bomb. Okay, blow the bomb. Right, let's get the detonator out. There it is. Boom. Oh. The frame drop. She's okay though. Which is good. Right. Oh, crap. Um... <laughs> I didn't expect him to still be alive. Finally, we managed to kill him. Right. I have to say, the controls on this are a lot worse than... Uh, oh! No, we're not going to kill her. Escape! There we go. The controls are a lot worse than on uh, the HD version. Or maybe I'm just blessed by uh, further ones. But there you go, Killer uh, Massacres uh, 17, apparently. I don't know what all that is about. But you can read about it. Uh, and it's actually quite cool to read. All of this is accurate stuff. It'll talk about the guards and stuff. You can see uh, he was killed. Um... Mr. Clarence was believed to be the victim in a violent episode. 16 um, additional deaths, but um, as you go throughout the series, um, if you get spotted and stuff and aren't a silent assassin, they'll, they'll figure out your, your face, and in later missions, uh, people will be scared when they see you and stuff, which is really, really cool. But that is Hitman Blood Money. We will see if there's any sort of cutscenes or whatever, but uh, hopefully you enjoyed it. So there you go, that is that. I think we'll leave it at that. But uh, that is Hitman Blood Money, so hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, then make sure you leave a like down below. Read really does help, uh, help me out, it means a lot to me as well. Let me know if you'd like to see more stuff like this in the future, or whether you'd just like to see it stick to sport. Um, but these are the sort of games I play in my free time anyway. Uh, subscribe to the channel for regular retro content, and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching, and goodbye. Thank you.